everybody. We are here at the Mandalay Bay in Las Vegas, Nevada. We're going to do a tour of the resort, check out what restaurants they have here, and we'll show you guys around. So let's go and check it out. This way to hotel and registration. So as you enter in this way, this is into the main hotel. This way. So over here, this is the bell desk right here on the left. Over here on the right, this is all hotel registration. We also have Michael Jackson 1 here at the Mandalay Bay, which is a Cirque du Soleil show. We have MLB Lifestyle right here, right when you come out of registration. It looks like it's closed right now, so we're going to keep going over this way. If you go down these stairs here, this will take you down to the beach level, which has the pools, valley pickup, restrooms, and spa. Over here, as soon as you come off the escalator, is the shuttle and tour pickup section down here. And then this here is the cardio section here at the resort. This is beach coffee and ice cream, but it's not open at the moment. Baggage frame over here. Keep uh, coming through this way. This will take you to the elevators, the beach, and the spa. We also have Jungle Juice Spirits down here, but it looks like it's closed at the moment. We have the foundation room here on property. And if you go over here, this is Hazel Coffee and Cocktails. It's a really cool looking bar. I like how cool it looks, I like the green, and just has like a really fun looking atmosphere to it. To our right is the valet and taxi service. And straight in front of us is Masura. Next door to that is Paradiso.
to the right now. Keep coming over here. Next door is Bella Scarpa. Looks like it's a shoe store. And next door to that is Ruby Blue. I think it's just random stuff. These are just restrooms. If you keep going up the stairs here, this is the tram station, so that'll take you to the tram that takes you to Luxor. Excalibur, and then you can also go to the T-Mobile Arena and the park as well. Next door to that is Starlight Tattoo. So next door to Starlight Tattoo is the House of Blues here on property. On the right next to the House of Blues is a Starbucks. The Mandalay Bay is connected to the Mandalay Place. It's just a little mall area. You can come in here and shop. Across from us is Big Chill where they have like frozen margaritas, pina coladas, things like that. They're more like slushies. And then next door to that, you can come over here and this is the ticket office. So you can come here and you can buy tickets to Michael Jackson won and stuff like that. Pretty neat stuff. Next door to that is Bet and Jam. This is their giant sports book that they have here on the property. And it is also connected to their poker room. Pretty neat. Next door to that is David of Geneva, where they have like, watches and scars and stuff. Next door here, they do have this little bar here probably, which looks pretty nice. It's pretty cool. So over here on the right, as soon as you come away from the casino, it's essentials. This is where you can buy your water and chips and beer, anything you may need here on property. Sort of that is S Bar, which is a nightclub with resident DJs and sounds. It looks like it's a pretty cool looking bar. This is S Bar here on property. We also have light. This is like a Club, I guess. When you go this way, this is the self parking in Uber. Right off these doors here. So, this is the Lupo here on property by Wolfgang Puck. So, pretty neat. I'm going to keep going down over here on this way. Keep going down this way. So over here they have Citizens, which is another restaurant here on property. And 
across from that is Fleur. So this here is Fleur, which is, a metro, which is another restaurant here on property. We also have a little section here for your Raider stuff. Shop. And next door to the noodle shop, you have Sea Breeze Cafe. This will take you over to the market where you can buy sodas and drinks and coffee and water. This is also the elevator section. This is Optica right here. You can get some glasses. And then this will take you back here to the main lobby where registration is. This sand sculpture for the Mandalay Bay. Looks pretty cool. I'm going over this way now. Let's keep going over this way. This is Kumi Japanese. This is a restaurant and bar. There is their menu. So this is Libertine Social Gastro Pub. Straight across from us is strip steak. So both of them like that. It says strip steak is a Michael Mina restaurant. Looks pretty nice inside. If you'd like to see the menu for strip steak, here is the cue car code. And then next door to that is another Starbucks coffee here on property. And you also have Libertine to go over here, so you can order coffee, it looks like. And if you keep coming down this way, this will take you over to Shark Reef, as well as the convention centers down here. Here is the view of the pool here on property. So as you can see, it's a really big pool area. Pretty big. This will take you over here to Shark Reef as well as Border Grill. So over here you have Border Grill. So this is Border Grill. It's a pretty big spot it looks like. And then next to that we have Barbecue Mexicana, which is like it's just like a little quick service area. This is also where you can go to get your wedding sun here on the property. So this is Weddings by Mandalay Bay in here, but it does say you need an appointment to go into it. This is the wedding photography area right here. And this is also their food court. So this is Shark Reef, and this is also where you would go to buy your tickets for Shark Reef. 
and it's also next door to the food court. So we have a subway here, we have an Asian restaurant, we have Nathan's, Johnny Rockets, and Ben and Donner's pizzeria. Next door to that, they also have the Central, which is more little supplies than we need. And then here's another look of the restaurants. Pretty big food court area. And that is our tour of the Mandalay Bay in Las Vegas, Nevada.